Are you ready to make your own ch Are you ready to make your own chili sauce? One dozen dried whole chili flakes. Make sure you remove the stems. 25 to 30 grams dried chili flakes. Did I already say chili flakes? Or did I say chili peppers? Well, you saw it. Two teaspoons of salt. Make sure it's dried salt. Wet salt will not do. Pulse it until finely chopped using a food processor. How do I do this? Ha! Five hundred milliliters boiled water. Make sure you look at the bottom of the meniscus so that you can actually accurately measure. More, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Perfect. Five hundred mils boiling water. Add in your dry. 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 Dry chili mixture and whatever that cutter thing is. Do not stick your hand into boiling water, children. Plastic. Just as planned, reduce the heat and allow it to simmer until two thirds of the water is gone. What's two thirds of 500? Uh, okay, it's been simmering down to one third of its original volume. Add in 500 milliliters of cider vinegar. White vinegar will do. And six tablespoons of white sugar. Bring it back to a boil. And then let it simmer for another 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. Pour the cooled hot sauce back into the food processor. And this time we need to make sure it's totally liquid. Ah, it's splashing everywhere. Make sure you get the dregs from the side. Scrape those juicy bits. I'll just check it as I go past the max line. Oh. I don't know. You know the camera hears you whisper, right? Yeah. No, it has not gone past the max line. Yes. So we're good. This time with longer pulses. <laughs> wow. Maybe it didn't get past the last line. <laughs> Maybe we need to pull some out. Maybe I don't know how to. No, no, no. We need to pull some out. And then it says max it. here. I know, babe, but I don't think this is designed for liquids. Wow. Let's turn it off. Filled everywhere, so I'm dip trying it in this one. We'll see if that helps. I have no idea if this is gonna work. Hmm. Should I turn it down a bit? You could do, but you can also just leave it for longer.
terrifying. Yeah, let me try to hold that. What the heck? Don't lift it up. Don't lift it up. It's a nightmare. I have no idea how to use this stuff. It looks great. Shall we okay. decant? This is so easy. Okay, so after you've cleaned up any mess that you made there, uh, you'll probably knock the whole thing over and you'll have almost nothing left. So then uh, that'll take you about 45 minutes to clean all that stuff up. But then you can pour <laughs> the rest of the stuff in there. I've discovered it's very important that you not lift this kind of blender whilst blending. Watch this. So, yeah, I know. <laughs> So, it's very easy to make your own hot sauce. Okay, it's done. It's ready to bottle. Boiling hot water totally sterilized all the bottles and everything, so there's no germs on here. The best way to get it out is use one of these. Oh. Oh, use one of these <laughs> these things with all the holes in it. It's very hot, so you don't want to be you don't want to be touching that boiling hot water. <sighs> So hot. I need some chopsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing at me. Why are you laughing at me? Okay, I think it's cool enough to handle now. Yeah. <sighs> Still so hot. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You're supposed to take care of me. Making your own hot sauce is super easy. Water in the top. Boop. Ready? Yeah. So you'll end up with about one full bottle after you spill about half of everything that you've made. So any leftovers from that full bottle that you haven't spilled yet, you can put into your second bowl. Okay. And that is done.